welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for joining me. If you are new, welcome. I'm Katie, and if you are a Tina subscriber, thank you for being here. Um, today I'm bringing you a Marks and Spencer's spring edit. So all of the gorgeous like floral, floaty dresses, frills, um, very pastel -y tones, very neutral colours, um, and a few brighter ones for me, which is a, a nice change. Um, so I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you do, please remember to hit that subscribe button and the thumbs up. If you have a favourite item, I'd love to hear what it is down below. And if you make it all the way to the end of the video, I'm going to leave a um, quote of the day that I want you to leave in the comment box. So the first item I'm going to share with you in this haul is this really, um, not very me colour actually. I'm, I've mentioned into more colours for me recently and I'm loving them. Um, so this little like shirt dress, um, it's a midi length which I think is just great. It means you won't have to worry about being a bit chilly. It's also got lovely long sleeves which I think really really important in that spring time of year. Especially in the UK we don't actually ever get full blown hot hot summers, well very rarely. So something like this will actually be great for to take you in from spring to summer. Um, I really love the structure of this dress, it just fits really really lovely. Everything I bought in this haul is in a size 12. Um, everything fit lovely and I will link everything down below in the description box for you as well as always with all my videos. So this dress was £45 um, and I think it's honestly worth it. The shape of the dress is lovely, the fit of the dress is lovely, the quality of it is just really nice. It's got a lovely structure, it's got really simple button details. Everything is just like such an easy to wear simple piece. Just put this on in the summer, some like nude, um, light cream, flip flop sandals. It's just so easy to wear. Nude cream bag, nice little sun hat if you want to take it in the summer. But this is just a perfect piece to start off your spring um, collection with. So the next item I've got is this really cute little dress. So when it came, I wasn't really sure about it, um, especially because of this sort of like detail here tends to uh, mm, exaggerate the bust area. Like, I know I don't have a very big bust, which I think is why it probably didn't bother me too much today, but if I was wearing a normal bra or perhaps a bra with padding in, it wouldn't look so flattering. So I would say this would suit more of a shape with a smaller bust. Um, I really love the sleeves on this. They've got a really cute little frill. Obviously it's pink, my favorite color. It's got a little polka dot, my favorite pattern. I'm not really one for like prints and patterns, but this whole haul is pretty much prints and patterns. Um, but polka dot has always been something that's in my wardrobe. Only recently I've started venturing more into um, prints and things like that. So um, nice to bring some different things into your wardrobe though and try something that you perhaps feel a little bit out of your comfort zone with. This dress is £29.50 and I have also got it in a different colour and style. Um, it's exactly the same. It's got really nice frill detail at the bottom, which I just love. It's really easy to just wear, chuck on. Again, it's a whole outfit. This is what I love about dresses. They're just like one whole outfit in one. You haven't got to think about the trousers, the jacket, the this, the that, the that. Nice little cream cardigan on top of here and your whole outfit is basically done. It's so easy. Just pick up the colour that's in there. Use that polka dot colour for your shoes, your bag. It's literally that easy, it's so simple and it's under £30, I think that's a really, really nice piece. It's also one of those pieces that when it gets to summer and you're feeling like a bit hot and like frustrated, it's just gonna like just sit on you lovely. It's not gonna cling or be tight or irritate. You've got loads of movement in it, which I know sounds silly, but sometimes things can feel quite restrictive. And things like that are really important to me when I'm picking what I wear. Um, especially in the summertime where we can be irritated slightly easier than um, in the cooler months. Um, I also got this in a long, so obviously I'm five foot ten, and the fit and the length was absolutely perfect. So probably say anyone under five foot seven would probably just go for like the regular. I'm going to show you the um, one that's really similar. Um, so the style and the shape of the dress is exactly the same. All that's different is the print and obviously the colour. Um, so obviously we've got the same frill detail again. I wasn't sure about this one when it came out of the bag, but actually on, I did like it on. So I'll show you in the cutaway, and I paired the cutaway with some um, really easy to wear, just like white trainers, um, which I think are just a stable piece for any wardrobe, but I'll show you that in a bit more detail in a second. It's got this really nice ruching in at the waistband. It's like an elasticated waist, so again, like I said, it's gonna be really comfy to wear. 
Um, and this one again, I got in the longer length and it's the same price, £29.50. Has got like this little keyhole button bit at the back um, so you can undo it. It's also elasticated so you don't have to undo it because I know how fiddly they are when you try and do them at the back. So yeah, really easy to wear piece for your spring um, wardrobe and again, will take you into summer really nicely. Um, next I have a slightly longer, um, more of like a midi to maxi length dress. Um, it's got really nice little like cuff wrists. I don't know why I love these so much. I just really appreciate this wrist because I think for me, when they've got these little button details, sometimes they can be a bit of a pain to get them off. This just has nice stretchy bits. I'm just all about that ease, the comfort, you know, all about feeling comfy. So this is that dress that's gonna make you feel super comfy, but still really, like you've made an effort, you look really pretty, effortlessly pretty, I would say, this dress is. It's 45 pounds, and I got it in the regular length. So perhaps if I wanted it to be, I actually really like the length of this on me. Perhaps this on a five foot seven or under would be more of a maxi dress. But for me, this is just above the ankle. Um, but I actually really like the, the style of the, the length of the dress. I like the way it comes down into pleats. So it's got like um, three sort of sections. It stops here, further down and further down again. So it gives you that really nice, um, just like floaty look. Very, it makes you look longer basically than you are. So I felt very elegant in this, very girly, and it's got a really pretty um, flower pattern. The neckline is really nice on this, I really like the neckline. So it's got a normal like cuff collar there, and then it's got really simple buttons all the way down. Um, and for £45, like I said, it's like a whole outfit in just one dress. You could pair this with like a nice biker jacket, um, some black loafers, Really, really easy way to style that. I mean, it could also be something you take on holiday with you and you just chuck on after you've been in the pool because it's literally that like lightweight material. It's lovely, it's gonna be super versatile and I think it's a piece that you'll reach for a lot in your wardrobe this spring and summer. Okay, so this next item I absolutely am in love with. I'm gonna to have to check online to see if they do do it along because I got this in a regular and I definitely could have done with long. This is something that you could wear so either to like a wedding, to a christening, to, um, I don't know, any nice occasion that you've got that you want to feel a bit smart and sophisticated. The structure on this is gorgeous and it's only 59 pounds. Honestly, this feels like something that you can get from Karen Millen for like 220 pound or Reese that you can get for like 250 pound and it's 59 pounds. Like Marks and Spencers are really, really more affordable than I ever realized um, from doing this haul. So, like I said, I got this in a size 12. The fit of the body on everything was lovely. The only thing was it was a little bit short. I think the colour is the most beautiful thing I have ever seen. This is, if I could be a colour, I might be this with a tint more of pink, but <laughs> I just think it's the most elegant colour. It's the most feminine colour. And it's just so effortlessly classy and classic. It's never gonna go out of style because it's just that classic colour and a classic design. Um, it's something you can have in your wardrobe, I think, for years and just put out on those occasions where you don't know what to wear but you want to look effortlessly chic and glamorous. Um, but without feeling like you made too much effort. It's just, I absolutely love it. I cannot fault it. It's got nice little pockets on the side. It wraps around at the side. You can tie this in just a bow or a knot loosely, entirely up to you. The fit and the structure on this is just, it's just amazing. I, I'm in love with it. So if they do this in a long, this is gonna be my uh, new favorite piece for spring. The next dress, when I took it out of the bag, I wasn't too fussed on it. I wasn't too fussed on the pattern. However, when I put it on, the fit of this dress was gorgeous. Um, it went in at the waist, it's got a zip on the side to get you in and out of it. Um, you can do it up a bit tighter here, but it's more of like for show this is. Um, but this, oh my god, I really like, sorry. Um, the pleat on this dress is so flattering because I quite often find that pleats on dresses, if you have like quite womanly hips, I find them a little bit unflattering and I quite often steer away from pleats to be honest. Um, but this is the most flattering pleat I've ever worn. I just felt like when I turned to the side, I just looked slim and sleek and it was really, really nice. It made me feel really good about myself, which is, which is obviously how we want to feel as women, how I want you guys to feel, which is why I started this channel. I want you to feel your best all the time and not to feel like you spend loads of money or just dress right for your shape, but it's 
it's actually really simple. Um, it's got little button details on the sleeves and a lovely sort of like frill around the neck. The print on it, like I said, I'm not 100% sure about. Um, in my head, I thought this was red, so I bought this bag to, to style with it, which I'll show you. Um, but the, actually on the print, it doesn't, it doesn't not go, but it is orange, it's not red. Um, although, it's a very red bag. So um, with like a bit of an orange tint. So I reckon you could get away with it. It's a really nice, easy to wear bag. It is real leather. Sorry, my vegan friends. Um, I don't really support real leather. I didn't really realize it was real leather when I ordered it. I just thought that looks pretty, bought it, didn't really think. But obviously I don't keep everything from my hauls, so this will go back. Um, it is £59, which I just think is actually really expensive for an item this small. Um, I just, it is really cute. I love the style, the shape of the bag, but I just know you could get something really similar in pre mark for like £8. Um, so if you want, I guess, something that's going to last you a really long time and you don't mind that it's leather, then you could perhaps go for this piece. But otherwise, I would um, probably tend to opt for a alternative in a cheaper place. So I have another bag for you again. This one again is real leather. This one is absolutely stunning. And um, I really, I'm like too, I'm just really torn when I talk about that real leather because I really don't believe in harming or killing animals, especially not for fashion or even to eat. Like I actually don't eat animals either. It's just, it's just been happening so long it's become really normal. So this is a beautiful bag, it's absolutely gorgeous, it's probably one of the most beautiful bags I've ever seen and held. Um, but then my other part of my brain is like, yes, but it's from a cow and it's not okay. A £69, pound, um, I'm just going to leave it there because I don't really know what else to say. Um, like I said, I didn't really realise when I was ordering them, they were genuine leather, but I do want to show you them because they are really gorgeous bags. Um, however, you can actually get vegan leather. Um, so perhaps look at that as an alternative in this style of bag because it's a gorgeous style. Okay, so the dress that I showed you earlier, um, that long maxi one, this is what I styled these trainers with. So these are just a really easy to pair, um, wear pair of trainers. They'd be really great to just keep in your wardrobe, one of those things that you reach for time and time again. These actually say suitable for vegans on, which I like. Um, and they say light as air. They were £45. They are really, really light. Um, and they would just be something I guess you just grab for in the summer, even this time of year, but maybe more so in the spring summer when you're not ready quite to wear flip flops yet or you just want to wear something that keeps you know, you a little bit warm um, as well as, and they're just easy to style with like any sort of just like chuck on dress, chuck on trainers. I just think it's such a, it's a, it's a trend at the minute and it is a really nice trend. I really enjoy it um, because obviously I find trainers way comfier than heels and being tall, it's the best of both heels for me because they're flat. So I really like these. I just think they're really basic. If you are in the market for a pair of basic white trainers, these are the ones for you. Okay, so when I got these out of the bag, I was like, oh no. I was like, I love them, but I don't at the same time. And then I put them on, they went with every single outfit and I fell in love with them. And then I didn't want to take them off. So <laughs> they're absolutely stunning, I love them. They're really like a little bit 60s, they're like really funky, maybe 70s, I don't know what era, maybe even 80s. I just think they're really cool. I've always liked this like slightly square toe design. I also like the really pointy ones as well, but I love like these square heels at the minute. They're just, they're just a really nice pair of easy to wear shoes. The heel height is not too high gonna be super easy to wear all day long. Um, I just really like them. They're just gonna go with so much um, in your spring summer wardrobe. If you are like me and you wear light colors with any of the new pastel shades that are out at the minute, they're gonna look great. So these are 45 pound. And I would say definitely get the, your normal size on these because I got seven and a half and I'm normally a seven and they're a little bit big. These I didn't actually feature in the video, but I do just wanna show you them because I think they're really cute. They didn't actually go with anything I was really wearing. I guess when I saw them, I was like, oh, just automatically thinking of summer. Um, so I just wanted to show you them in case you're one of those people that's like me that needs to get things like this when they see them because when it comes to summer, you can't find them. Um, so these will look great in the summer with just like white jeans, white um, denim skirts, really just like easy to wear pieces or just to take on holiday just to check on the £19.50. 
and these as well say vegan on the bottom so that's great i love that companies are actually becoming more aware of these things now and seeing that producers don't actually want to buy uh, producers what are we called buyers don't actually want to buy dead animals to wear on our feet okay so how hard is it to find a decent pair of jeans in the world it is honestly i find it one of the hardest things um being tall for one and also just like, I guess my shape. I just find it really, really hard. These, however, fit me like a glove. They're absolutely amazing. And they were only £19.50. I got them in a long 12. The length was perfect. The fit was perfect. And I really would keep them. But I just, I just don't like this little bit of detail personally on here. Which is such a shame because I feel like I've been looking for jeans for so long. I also don't really want them to look as washed out as they are. I think in my head they were going to be like a little bit of a darker denim. But it is hard to buy jeans online. So... I do feel like maybe I'll take them back into the shop and I will swap them for another pair. But the fit on these was absolutely amazing. I just wanted to say the quality on the fit is just great. So definitely have a look at Maps and Spencers if you want to look for um, some new jeans. These ones are the skinny and mid rise, and I loved like the height of how they came onto the body. They just fit great. Um, yeah, literally nothing bad to say about these. And they are resource responsibly sourced cotton. Which again, I also like that people are being mindful of these things. So next I'm going to talk about what I'm wearing right now. This is a really cute, it's almost satin. It's almost satin, but it's not quite. There's no shine to it. Um, but it just looks, look, like just look at the detail on it. I just love the colours. I think the detail is stunning. Um, I got this actually, this is the only thing I got in a size 10. Oh, I didn't realise it had pockets, do you? It has pockets. Um, which I didn't realise. Oh, I like this even more now. Okay. This was actually in the sales. I'm not sure how many of these will be left online now. However, I will try and find the link and link it down below. Um, it fits really gorgeous. Obviously, you could do it all the way up. You could do it lower down. Maybe wear a top underneath it. Um, it's got a pull-in at the waist. And this one is slightly bigger. It's got, it's got a lot of material. So definitely, if you're normally like a size 12 and you bought a size 10, I must have bought a size 10 because maybe they didn't have a 12. Or I just saw maybe that I'm sure on Marks and Spencer's website it says if it fits small or big I think this one said it's quite big fitting so I bought obviously a smaller size so that's a really nice key feature as well to use on there this was £55 it's now down to £34 I think it's just one of those gorgeous things that you'll just reach for and people will be like wow that looks so expensive £34 amazing amazing literally amazing it's just so effortlessly chic and glamorous and girly and feminine and all the things I just love. Um, this is one of my favourite pieces actually. I wasn't sure what this was going to be like and when I went online um, I wanted it in like an off minty colour and they also had like an off pinky colour which were both sold out. So I went for this colour which was like the next best thing but this is like the whole colour of my wardrobe anyway, this and black. So I know I'll get so much more out of it. It's £29.50 and I got it in a large. The reason I got it a large is because I wanted it to be slouchy, but it actually fit me absolutely perfect in the, in the way that I wanted it to fit. Um, it wasn't too long, wasn't too slouchy that it was like frumpy, but it was ju it just just sat in the right place, basically. I absolutely love it. I love how chunky the knit detail is on it. I just think it's stunning. Um, it's going to be so cosy and just so nice to just chuck on over little things like this, just to wear around the house, to wear with a plain pair of jeans like I did in the styling. It's just so easy and gorgeous, gorgeous piece that will just last you forever in your wardrobe basically. Um, and perfect for springtime when it's still a little chilly and you want to put something on, just be like a little bit snug, but you want your outfit still to look chic. Perfect! And the last thing I'm going to talk to you about is very similar to what I showed you earlier. So very similar to the loafers, um, but a little heel detail. And again, I didn't style these with anything because these again are more for what I would add to my summer collection rather than spring. Um, so these with like a white linen dress or something is going to look so effortlessly chic. I think they're really gorgeous, really nice, really easy to wear. I love the heel style, the heel height. I love the colour. I just think these are going to be like literally a really really wearable piece in the summer. They are vegan again and £29.50. Um, so these are just really gorgeous and I think you'll be grateful you bought these now because in the summer they won't be around anywhere. They never are. Always the way. On that note, actually, um, I have picked up lots of bits from Primark, 
which are going to be added to my summer wardrobe because this time of year is almost key to buy all the things that you want for later in the year because when it actually gets to summer there's no swimwear around there's no nice pieces around it's really hard to find the stuff you want in the season you want you have got to be a bit on the ball with these things and get them a bit early so i've got a few swimmer pieces um and just some like nice spring summer colors um yeah to add in there so, so make sure you are subscribed to so make sure you see that video as it will be coming up next week on my channel thank you all so much for being here let me know down below which is your favorite item and if you did make it to the end of this video i would love for you to leave a comment saying with love katie Thank you all for being here. Take care and I'll see you soon. Bye.